Hi everybody, welcome to Phoenix Energy Bricks. Since my childhood I like Lego and on this channel I want to share with you the collecting of Lego bricks and Lego sets. I have also an idea for an actual video game which is connected with this guy here but more about this project at the end of the video. So today I want to share with you a Lego submarine vehicle. So as you know I brought from eBay 10 kilogram Lego bricks without knowing uh, which sets I can actually build with them with no instructions etc. And with the help of Bricklink I try to rebuild these sets. So this is a very, very cool Lego submarine vehicle but I do not know the uh, Lego number, the article number. And the uh, set which he came. But you will see the title of this uh, Lego submarine vehicle and the number in the description box below or in the title of the video. So here he is. He is a very cool uh, Lego submarine vehicle. And he has here printed parts which is cool that these are not stickers. So which is also cool that these parts here can already rotate 360 the back section here the turbines can also move 360 and which is cool that the uh, these propellers here can also uh, rotate here we have gas tanks and uh, here are, will be came more accessoires so when i have finished this build up i want to make an uh, uh, or separate review so you can see the difference between this build and the fi final build so here he is from side from front with the shooting barrel other side the back section also this part here can rotate The bottom and the cockpit. The cockpit is very simple, but which is also cool that he has a printed cockpit here. This is not, not a sticker. And which which I like about submarine vehicle is when you have a blue bottom here, you can imagine that uh, this uh, vehicle here uh, can uh, dive in the sea like this. And it's cool uh, to combine Lego sets with uh, something who you have painted. This is also cool. Which I like is that this is a Lego submarine vehicle, but it looks like uh, a little bit an aircraft, like a space aircraft. So you can also imagine that he's flying in the sky. This set doesn't. Uh, I do not found in the 10 kilogram Lego bricks. A, a, a Lego minifigure which he came so um, I have to build this uh, submarine without a minifigure but overall a very cool cool vehicle so that was it and now to the uh, idea of the actual video game. So this is the Phoenix Warrior. This is an action figure which I customized on myself and also the artwork which you see at the beginning of the video was made by myself. I made also a comic art illustration story cartoon for this uh, guy here and I want to share with you this idea, this comic, this concept with, uh, with you at, at the end of each video which I make. So it would be cool if this idea can grow with you, the viewers, uh, Lego bricks. And, the, uh, and this idea. So it would be cool uh, to go, I thought, why not going to an actual video game developing company and say, hey, I have an idea for an actual video game. What do you think about turning this idea into reality? So I'm not a programmer, I can't do this on myself, but I thought why not 
uh, going with this idea to an actual video game developing company. And I want to inspire you also, if you have ideas, to turn them into reality or to search for opportunities how you can turn uh, your ideas into reality. That would be cool. It would be cool to know your opinion about the comic. So if you and this idea uh, and the uh, and the uh, channel in, uh, in all, so it would be cool if you could write your uh, opinion down in the comment section below. If you like, you can all also subscribe. And now the story of the Phoenix Warrior.